Way Cyber arrives as a retrowave electric dirt and road bike with a hexagon aluminium body and customizable neon lights. The brake lights and turn signals of the bike are deemed to be two of the seemingly endless features and that makes the bike different than any usual bike. This light poles flash and blink when the rider needs to brake or make a left or right turn. The LCD screen display flashing power gauge and information to the rider, and it's possible to connect the rider's smartphone via Bluetooth for navigational purposes and even install a USB port into the e-bike for charging, and it can also charge electronics devices. This bike can achieve a top speed of 55 miles per hour and can cover a ultra-long range of up to 250 miles. With his 88L of onboard storage you can put your loads inside, giving you everything you need to go anywhere you want. People are migrating to the world's cities on huge numbers, and that is going to ask some serious questions of our current transportation systems, urban traffic, and air quality. That's why Bell Company made the Nexus Flying Taxi which will be our feature transportation. The Air Taxis, a hybrid propulsion and drive system are designed by French manufacturer Safran helicopter engines and center around six rotors that lay flat like pancakes when it's on the air or it's stationary on the ground. Power comes from a mix of onboard batteries and gas turbine that drives an electrical generator, these in turn drive the six tilting propellers to provide lift speed and flight control through the air. Imagine if an emergency vehicle could not only booking the team of responders to the edge of the disaster zone but actually step right in, striding over top flaming rubble to get respondents exactly where they need to be. That's the all-new Hyundai Elevate concept, moving through the world on fully articulated wheeled legs that let it climb vertical walls, hop over crevasses, crawl like a reptile and quietly cruise the highway. This concept has been in the world for well over two years and was imagined specifically with emergency response in mind. Imagine a tsunami or earthquake hit, this vehicle can drive to the scene and climb right over flood debris or concrete. Each leg includes five degrees of movement. The vehicle can use the height and power of its legs to react standing tall and clearing large obstacles, crawling along like a reptile climbing walls up to five feet high, defeating obstacles like large boulders, deep snow, and steep hills. It's support by a 66 kilowatt hour battery pack. The all-new Mustang GTD is the most advanced, audacious Mustang ever, ready to break off the circuit and onto the street. The absolutely hellacious new coupe features a full carbon fiber makeover, active aerodynamics bumper-to-bumper, -bumper, a first-of-its-kind adaptive street-slash-track suspension, and a supercharged V8 that powers the rear wheels via a carbon fiber driveshaft. The scooped hood and roof are also made from carbon fiber, helping to keep overall weight low and centered near the ground. A carbon fiber driveshaft ensures that weight is even out around a 50 colon 50 front slash rear distribution while sending power from the front mounted 5.2 liter supercharged V8 to the rear wheels through an 8-speed double clutch rear transaxle of Ford plans to launch the 2025 Mustang GTD in late 2024 slash early 2025. Each model will start around 300,000 US dollars. Asuido has created the DI
Robotics offers its own EVTOL Thruala flying car, a concept flying car that would have a driving range of 200 miles and a flight range of 110 miles. As the team believes,